former CEO, Nazrat, grew up in a refugee camp in Pakistan before moving to Afghanistan to work with the U.S. mission. He would later be brought to the U.S. on a special immigrant visa where he would found a seal. He wanted to give opportunities to aid recipients like himself. Abdul, one of our aid recipients and artisans, began weaving carpets while living in a refugee camp in Pakistan. He is unable to sell his carpets to anyone outside of his village because he has no technology to reach customers globally, nor the ability to take electronic payments and ship his products. He also does not have the ability to market himself to potential customers outside of his village. Like Abdul, there are 3 billion people across the globe who do not have access to the global market. A seal gives Abdul a platform to list his carpets and market them to buyers all over the world. Through a seal, Abdul can list his products, he can take payments, and then those products are shipped through a seal. A seal serves as a trusted partner for both the buyer and seller to complete secure transactions. A seal is more than just an e-commerce platform. Building on the infrastructure, we have a direct humanitarian impact on our artisans and their communities. Abdul is able to use a seal to get direct aid to both his family and his community through the platform. Buyers can track and identify the beneficiary using Hope ID cards. Buyers will then receive photo updates of packages being delivered to recipients to see the actual impact that they're making. These packages could be in the form of food, winter help, baby assistance, life care packages, first aid, or even cash transfers. There is 1,815 billion in market opportunity between handmade, humanitarian, and grants and contracts, with a $3.4 trillion of potential value by 2030. There is competition in the marketplace. However, we are the only app designed for underdeveloped countries. We're also the only app that offers direct access to these underdeveloped countries. Unlike our competitors, we also have a 16% overhead compared to 50% or more from some of our competitors. We have over 10,000 active customers and have helped over half a million people in some of these underdeveloped countries. We've been featured in Time, NPR, and on the BBC. This team is poised to take a seal to the next level. Combined, we've raised over $400 million. We have one IPO and over 110 years experience in the global development space. In 2020, our revenue was 1.5 million. In 2023, we're forecasting $16.7 million with a 16% fee for every transaction. This also includes $800,000 in confirmed client revenue commitments for 2023. We've currently raised $1 million. We are asking for $4.7 million. We will be using that to expand to new countries, staff salaries, UX UI improvements, onboarding additional artisans, and marketing efforts. Thank you so much. And I look forward to seeing you in the breakout room or you're able to visit us on a sealapp.com slash connect. Mm -hmm.